Hi Pisces, welcome to your first ever weekly taroscope with me Raphael Ray from Radiant Reality. It's an absolute pleasure to have you. Thank you so much for being here. Thank you so much for joining me. As you can tell I'm super super buzzed because it's been a long time coming. So many people have asked for this and it's my absolute pleasure to finally be able to make good on the promise that one day I would be doing weekly readings. So if you haven't already don't forget to like, share and subscribe to the channel. I would be eternally grateful for it. Thank you so much for those of you that have. If you would like to book a personal tarot reading with me you can do so on the email address below also if you haven't seen it yet don't be don't uh, don't forget to check out your solar eclipse in leo special uh, for your sign and also don't forget to check out the retrogradia a mini series it's a three-part series about all the retrograde energy that's going to be shaping up before we start i would like to bless both of these decks with all forms of love light peace prosperity and abundance and i pray that the messages that come through are ultimately clear and concise and they help you on your path to your highest vibrational good so your destiny card is about the overarching theme for the week it's the biggest event that's likely to take place but it's also the the, the um the overall experience or, or texture or feel to the week you get the magician card look at this i mean this is beautiful the magician talk i think the interesting thing about this is virgo got this same card i think it was virgo virgo or libra one of those anyway if it is virgo it's really interesting and a certain person will know why so the magician card talks about having the experience of finally leveling up if this is about you becoming a master it's about finding your power and it's about staking your claim to the universe of that power when you see here it says as above so below so he's pointing the, the wand up to the to the heavens now the wand in, in tarot in any magical system actually represents your willpower and to me, when he's raising his will, his you know his wand up to the sky, that's him aligning his own will to the divine will. And when you can do that, that's when you're in a space to truly manifest anything so below, so that you can manifest your dreams. And the reason you're doing that is because you're co-creating, you're utilizing the grand plan, the grand design of the cosmos, tapping into its energy and creating or co-creating as I like to say whatever your destiny should be this week you're going to be finding your power and this week you're going to be speaking up um, Pisces is not really one to roar but this week they will be heard um, and I feel sorry for anybody that tries to step on your toes Pisces I really do this is a really beautiful card because it's pure power it's pure directed force you are strong this week my Pisceans, you are strong and you are capable and you are damn well able. So the direction is the likely way that you get there or the way that this is uh, you know potentially manifests for you. Let's have a look and see what comes up. You get the nine of wands, this is interesting. So it's interesting because the nine of wands is about completion it's about reaching the, you know the end of something in terms of its numerology in terms of the tarot this is almost at the end and when you see the nine of wands this is about not being heard it's about not being listened to <laughs> and it's funny isn't it then that I, you know i come up with that this will be the week where you stand up and be counted this will be the week where you really make yourself heard where you choose to be heard you're not going to have that experience again you're not those are the, the words that come with this card not going to do that again not going to try that again not excuse me not going to have that experience again the beauty of this spread in general is that the magician brings you the final wand that you need the magician brings you the final wand so you've got the nine there this is you nearing or, or gathering up the things that you want to say or the experience that you want to have or do and then he brings you the final one to say right now that you've got it all in here and you understand what it should look like and how it should be i'm going to give you the final wand to wave so that you can bring it into existence this can be a really powerful week for you pisces and what it will probably likely see you doing is speaking your truth like never before the other thing about the magician card is it's all to do with communication this is somebody that is mastered communication or the art of communication uh, you know and this isn't just communication of self by self it's communication with the cosmos at large i wish you an abundance of love light peace prosperity and abundance itself have an amazing week and i will see you very soon for more videos take care